Hello everyone. Um, hope you follow me on my journey. I'm doing a 21 day fast. I was in Peru three weeks ago. Got some kind of intestinal parasite. Hi. Um, I put myself on Hi. two different antibiotics. Did not work. So... Um, I was studying and reading about fasting, and some interesting things came up. There's a lot of studies um, from Germany um, and other countries about fasting and the benefits of fasting. Um, and one interesting thing was if you fast, your body goes through this protective phase where it protects the cells, your natural, your normal cells. Um, the little boy wants to be a part of everything. <laughs> um, it protects the cells. And even if um, you were, say, for instance, one study was about cancer and fasting. And what they found was people who fasted before cancer treatments actually did better with those side effects um, like nausea, vomiting, etc. And then it went further um, to figure out, well, why is that? And so they found that the genes in the, in the cells, they actually pro build a shield around them, so to speak, to protect the cells. And then because the cancer cells are abnormal, they actually are not protected in the same way. And they actually are more sensitive to the cancer treatments. So that was one thing. And then they went even further to say, um, and to, you know, do a research, find out that even without cancer treatments, they found that fasting followed the same guidelines in itself and that cells are, normal cells are protected and the cancer cells actually fail um, in regard um, and regardless of if there was cancer treatment involved or not. So that was some interesting things. But um, I'm trying to figure out what's going on with me and my body. Um, and we owe it to ourselves to, to do that. You know more about your body than a doctor that sees you 20 minutes and half of the time don't even talk to you. Um, in my practice, I try not to do that. But um, regardless, um, that's the way it is. And it's not the doctor's fault, really, because they're under pressure to see more patients. Um, and, and that's another story. So in any case, I'm on this journey, 21 days. Um, I do recommend a fast. In my office, we recommend a 21-day detox. Um, I've done that. Um, several times throughout the year, but this time I want to do just a fast. I want to get um, my body back into its normal state, um, and so we can see if I can starve these parasites out or whatever, but I got to do something to try to get me back to um, normal digestion. Um, so, for the next 21 days, it's just me and this right here natural spring waters right out of the source um 4, years yeah. old before it comes into this container and i typically just put a little lemon in it because i like lemon in my water <laughs> um and we all know the benefits of that as well so um follow me on my journey the first day um i'll be typically um using up my um, glucose stores the next two or three days will be challenging because that's when my body will go through this change because now I don't have any glucose stores and now it's going to try to um, convert fat and protein fat at a higher rate protein and a lesser rate um, for to, to in order for me to utilize some those stored glucose levels so Follow me on my journey. I'll keep you informed. Thank you.